is going on guys? Good morning. I have not had any coffee yet, so I'm really like I'm about to go and get some coffee right now. I actually just am driving Pat to work at a coffee shop called the Roastery, so he's gonna make me some coffee, right Pat? Yes, sir. He's gonna make me some coffee. I'm super excited. Let's bounce. <laughs> So Pat got me my coffee. It's fantastic. It's really out of my comfort zone with coffee because most of the time when I drink coffee, it's just straight espresso and nothing else. And this is like a couple shots of espresso and a bunch of milk and some cinnamon and uh, ginger and some other foo-foo And I, I don't know what's going on, but it's great. I love it. So today has just been a whole lot of editing all day. So I thought I'd sit down and talk to you guys a little bit about myself so you can get to know me a little bit and know who you're watching every day and all that fun jazz. As you guys probably know already, if you came here from Adam or you came here because you saw the Wolves video, so Adam challenged me to do 90 days with 90 videos. So 90 videos in 90 days, which is insane because I've never taken up any kind of task like that before. So I think this is gonna be a really cool challenge for me and it's gonna force me to be really creative and really pick up my camera and film every day. St. Louis, Missouri. I've lived there pretty much my whole life. Uh, I just turned 20 a little bit ago and I moved to Kansas City. Something that really makes me me is when I was six years old, I actually learned my first magic trick and I don't do any magic anymore, but that led me on to circus performing. And I've actually been circus performing my whole life. I was working in St. Louis as a circus performer and entertainer, doing kids shows, birthday parties, weddings, corporate events, stilt walking, unicycling, juggling, all that fun stuff. I definitely want to do a video in the future on how to unicycle, a video in the future on how to juggle. That's a little bit of my background. I got really interested in video and in YouTube and in Instagram and social media. I've been around it my whole life, but I really got interested in it from BMX edits as a little kid. So I'd watch these BMX edits and they were amazing, super cinematic, you'd have stuff in slow motion. Uh, I got really inspired by people like Peter McKinnon, people like Adam Horwitz. some of Adam's videos. So a long time ago, a couple years ago, uh, my brother came rushing into my room and said, Will, check out this video. It's the coolest video I've ever seen in my whole life. This video blew my mind. It inspired me to go and pick up a camera and start making content, start creating cool stuff, and start really getting into video. I've grown very passionate about video as well, and I love it. I love every second of it.
like a little kid. And by that, what I mean is I wanna go out and experience the whole world and see things with my own eyes for the first time. You know when you were a little kid and you have your first memories of seeing the world for the first time? What I like to tell people is when I was a little kid, I have the memory of going to my back fence and looking over it and seeing the huge field behind my fence for the very first time in my entire life. And that was the craziest moment for me. I never knew that that existed before. And that was just in my backyard. Now imagine what I felt like when I went to California. I felt the same way. I felt like that little kid again. And that's what I want to feel like every day. And that's what I want to go out and experience every single day of my life. You can't stop a little kid. You ever see a little kid run really, really, really fast and then face plant and then get right back up again and keep running? It's because everything's so new and awesome that even if a little kid falls down, the world is so crazy that he gets right back up again and goes right back out in it full force. mindset where life is too short to not do the things you want to do you know and I really want to go and experience I really want to go and see I really want to go and see the world with my own eyes and do cool things and see crazy things and I think the only way to do that is to take a risk and so the risk that I'm taking was quitting my job in St. Louis and not going to college and picking up a camera so that I can record all of it and have those memories forever. Life is definitely too short to just sit on your ass and do nothing. And that's why I'm here right now. Hopefully you guys will come with me throughout the next 90 days doing as much crazy stuff as we possibly can. But Adam dared me to upload a video every day no matter how cool something is, no matter how stupid something is, no matter if I think it's cool or not or whatever. Not every video is gonna be as cool as the Wolves Week video that I did hanging out with Adam in LA. But every video is gonna be mine. And I think that's what it really means to me. traveling as much as I possibly can for the next 90 days. I'd love to travel with as many people as I possibly can. So please, please, please hit me up. Let's travel together. Let's go and create some content. Let's make something happen together. Yeah.